Hey everyone, I'm Keisha Sherman and I'm back. I hope that you can hear me. I know it's kind of windy, so I'm gonna just speak up above the wind, hopefully. But right now I am in Best Eye. I'm on my way to Brownstone Bride to pick up my wedding gown. <laughs> um, this is gonna be my final fitting, I guess. And well, I guess all the adjustments should be made already. And I'm gonna just try it on one last time and take it with me. I have my shoes on. I mean, I have my shoes with me, so I'll be able to try it on with my shoes this time. I didn't get to do that last time. Um, but yeah, the the Lacnificent Hair Show is on Sunday. And that is Tondo Cafele's last hair show, allegedly, in New York City. I say allegedly because I just find it very hard to believe that he's really trying to retire from doing hair shows but uh, he says he's tired I understand we all gotta we all gotta know when to hold him and when to fold him so that's his last this is his last hair show in in New York I know there's um there's a hair show in Delaware that he's gonna go to that's I'll also be there but I won't be modeling for him this time but I'll be down there doing press and um, other things like stick, stick around. I'll, I'll have a video when that happens too. Um, but if you're gonna be in the Delaware area, October 10th, make sure you come out. I have the details down below. Okay. So, so yes, this is a this is gonna be a bridal, or I should say a wedding themed presentation. So it's just gonna be me and the groom as his models. And I don't want to spoil everything. I'm going to make you guys watch and see. Okay, stay tuned. Well, by the time you see this video, it'll already, it would have already happened. So I, I can, I can speak a little bit on it. But yes, um, so Brownstone Bride, where I'm going right now, Alexandra Manning, who is the designer, she actually, um, I worked with her several years ago. I did a commercial for her and uh, I um, I worked at one of her fashion shows and yeah that was really dope and yeah my locks were red at that time yeah that was such a long time ago but yeah time flies I'm still pretty much the same dress size pretty much so um, it was pretty easy for her to make this dress and yes it's a custom gown listen this this has me feeling like a, it's my actual wedding <laughs> because it's like I definitely I gave her like some input on the on the gown it was mostly her like 99% her but I had to give her some some input yeah and, and because it's only gonna be t us two models and if we're gonna be honest when it comes to weddings the bride steals the show all the time so, um, I'm gonna wait to light. <laughs> okay. <clears throat> when it comes to, to weddings, the bride always steals the show. It's the bride's moment, really. So, um, I, yeah, so this is gonna feel, it's gonna feel like a wedding. Obviously, not really because I have not even met the groom yet. <laughs> um, <laughs> but that's really funny that I never met the groom. I probably meet him the day of the wedding. Isn't that crazy? I never even met my groom. I'm about to get married and I never even met my groom. <laughs> but, um, yeah, I really don't know what to expect. I haven't seen the venue, so I don't, I don't really know, like, anything. I just know that I have one job, and that's to wear this gown, wear my locks. It's gonna be a curly updo. Which is ironic because I've, I've always said that when I have my wedding in real life, I want curly locks. And I think, if you know anything about me, you know I want some curls. <laughs> if, you know, if you follow me on, on this channel, then you know I love me some curls. When I get to the, the studio, I'm going to show you guys the dress. But meanwhile, let me give y'all a length check. Ha <laughs> ha. 
best side, so beautiful. get into it guys do you see this beautiful can go to my side oh yes brownstone bride you guys know where you need to go when you need your custom wedding gown made <laughs> yes get into the details Okay, you guys will see more at the event. Stay tuned. Hmm. So you guys saw the dress. You all saw the dress. Don't you love it? Don't you love it? I mean, it's gonna look a lot better once my hair is done and my makeup is done, but that dress, I may have to use that for my actual wedding. Like, I mean, I can't do that. I can't repeat the dress, right? I can't do that. Nah, I can't do that. I'll definitely have her design something else. I think it was something like off the shoulders maybe, or like strapless. You know, maybe strapless. Hmm, I got time, okay? I got time. I got time to play that. But yeah, so I'm gonna actually go and grab something to eat and then um, she's gonna do the final touches. She has to um, hem it. So, so I'll be um, getting some, some food and then coming right back. Yo, has this ever happened to you? Like, there's nobody on the block right here, right now. Yo, I'm walking and I'm like, why does it feel like my pants are falling down? Tell me why my pants are completely open. Completely. I'm wearing shorts, so it's, it's okay, you can see. Completely open. I gotta, I gotta go in a cut somewhere and zip this up. Thank you. Okay, good. Right. So I get to meet my groom before the wedding? Mm-hmm. Because <laughs> I, oh, I didn't tell you. Did you listen to the song? Yes. I, I, I've heard it before. So you know it? I don't know it, but... Oh, do I need to know it? No, he needs to, well, he, you do. Okay. But he really needs to know it. Okay. So I'm gonna play it and tell you what it is. Okay. Because that's the moment. That's, that's your moment. I'm about to meet my groom for the first time. But right now I'm in the middle of getting my hair twisted. Capelle is using my new gel. I'm using the Love Light and Lock gel on my hair. Only a fraction is done. Hello, hello. Hi. Good to meet you. Good to meet you too. Oh well. I'm, I'm vlogging, by the way. <laughs> hello, hello. Hi, this is my groom. This is Tommy. It's an honor. It's an honor. <laughs> T O B I. Yes. Keisha. Oh man. He told you that, man, we, we get married apparently, man. Like, yes. we've been married and all that. <laughs> yes. 
got to meet my groom the day before the, the wedding. <laughs> Feel a little arranged, don't it? A very arranged. <laughs> That's very accurate. <accurate-y. laughs> Um, man, but how y'all been? Y'all good? Great. Your hair looks really good. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah. <laughs> Listen, he, this the man shape. is blessed. The shape, the back shape of his body. Yes. I really appreciate it, man. I'm thankful. I'm blessed. <laughs> yes, God. I feel what, human again. What did Roderick say? <laughs> Sit up as high as you can. It's now the day of the show. I'm back under the dryer just to make sure my hair is perfectly dried so that the curls pop. As you know, when it comes to curling your locks, you want to start with damp hair and make sure it's fully dried before you take your rollers out. And that's how you get popping curls. That's how you get long lasting curls. This is gonna be so cute. I'm wearing a white, um, right now I'm wearing a white um, sweater dress. My gown is actually right there. It's in the bag. I'm wearing this white sweater dress to stay in the wedding theme, you know what I'm saying? Before and after um, the show, I thought that I should still wear white so I look bridal. After all, my hair is going to be bridal. My makeup, I tried to do bridal makeup. How do you think I did? I wish I had lash extensions so I wouldn't have to put these on. Because I feel like when you wear extensions for a while, and then you put on like the falsies, it just looks so cartoonish and clownish. Or is that just me? It just looks really extra, but I felt like Gotta have some lashes, and, and my, my extensions are gone, so I gotta have to glue on some lashes. But how's my shadow? I think it look, it's kind of bridal, I don't know. My lips definitely, I think. <laughs> Alright, so I'm going to just kick it under this dryer until it's done. And... Yeah, I'll be back. Thank you. 